worth their weight in gold. Uh, today we work on the core that will give you nice feeling, a nice sore, good sore feeling the rest of the week. Just a reminder that those muscles are alive. And then tomorrow, Sherry will stretch you out for rest. So 15 minutes here. What we're going to do is we're going to alternate. Uh, we're going to do three minute sets, five different three minute sets. Let everyone else come on in. We got Diane, Steph's even here, Betsy, Tiff, Arlene, Jan, Lindsay, Deb. I love it. Fran, Kelly, Kristen, Christina. We're going on and on. It's Monday. Amy B, Ash, Marley, Jen, Jane, Alyssa, Jen. All right, we're going to get started. First three minute set, standing core. If you'd like to grab some weights, you can. Um, not necessary. We can take them either both arms or I'm going to drop my top weight. We're going to start with the oblique roll down right here. So starting with the standing core, then we'll work our way to the floor for some planks. Then we'll come to our back. Then we'll work our back and then we'll do some side plank work too. Nice, nice and controlled, nice and controlled. You're coming straight down. Don't let those shoulders roll forward. Bring it up. You can also come to a side shrug if that feels better for you. Hello, Jennifer, Sarah's here. Heather, beautiful. And remember, in the middle of the day, you deserve this. It's not an inconvenience from our day. We deserve this. We need this. It's going to buy us more energy, more productivity. Two, one more. One, really squeeze this left side as you come up. Switch out the feet, so right foot forward, left foot out, bring it down, bring it up, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. If you want a little bit more right after this, well, 10 minutes after, on our Facebook and Instagram pages, um, I'm doing my Never Miss a Monday show, and it's going to be a nine-minute ABC workout, so arms, booty, and core, get a little bit more body weight, strength work, oh, this looks good, team. Oh man, it is so smoky out here. Um, I'm in the Eastern Sierras of California. Like it's, it's eerie. It's like red and it's like, whew. Another reason to be thankful for me fit. It works no matter what. All right, three, two, one. Now you're gonna come into a plie. You're gonna take a figure eight with the weights. Right here, if you can't get between the legs, you can come around the body right here. Come around. The body, if not, we're coming down. Whew. Not letting ourselves sit forward. There's more coming in. Good afternoon. It's officially afternoon. Five, four, three. Hello, Amy, Lisa, Eva. Two, whew. one. Don't trip on your weights. <laughs> All right, second weight. And if you don't have weights, that's okay. Well, one of my favorite standing core moves strength starts. I'm going to come down, I'm going to lift the left leg. Then I'm going to come back down nice and controlled. Lift the right. That's when your core is going to activate, when you're nice and slow. Down. Lift. Yes, come on. Push up, push up. Catch it at the top. How are we doing? Beautiful step. Looking good. Yes, Kristen. Look at you, Ashley. You're changing a diaper in the middle of. Get it done. Yes, Amy B. Diane. I love it. Nicole. Oh, my God. Is that Clara? So she, uh, she was like. <clears throat> A newborn back. Now you said she's going to kindergarten. That's insane. All right, hold it up on the left side. Hold it up. We're going to crunch. 10, 9, hello, Linda, 8, 7, 6. Try to keep this right arm up. 5, 4, there you go. 3, Woo. 2, one more. On this side, one, and then switch out the arms. We'll go 10 on the right side, 10. If this bothers your hip flexor, you can always straighten that leg. Seven, six, yes, nice, Sarah. Five, beautiful, Amber. Four, three, perfect. <clears throat> Two, how are we doing? Nice, Jen. Nice, Fran. One more, one more. There you go, Lauren. One. All right. Wait and come down. Come to the back of your mat. We're moving whoo, into it. See, just moving the body feels good. I was sitting way too long today. Uh, Monday's computer day for me. All right. We're going to walk our hands down. I have a few options for you here. You're going to roll up to the ball of your foot. 
You're gonna take those inchworms, walk it out, two, three. Try to take as many steps as you can, as many little steps. We have the standing option. We come down to our thighs, lift the heels. You're gonna balance here. And then walk it back up. And even if you're seated, right? Remember, we can come down. Two, three, we hold ourselves so we're not just flopping forward. We're holding nice and strong. There you go, Kelsey. Awesome. Erin, looking good. Erin, I love it, Karen. Look at all of you amazing moms at home, helping your kids through their schoolwork and all the distance learning. You deserve this time. And the kids, let them join you if they're around. They'll have fun with it too. Three, two, one. Okay, slow mountain climbers. These are hard. We bring our knee to our chest. Shoulders stay right over the wrist. Knee to our chest. Knee to our chest. So from the side, if I'm on my knees, my knee comes out to the elbow. And if I'm standing, whoo, I like to give all options. I'm slowly trying to just lift that knee up. Slowly trying to lift and lower. Come on, bring it in. We got two trainers in the house. We got Lindsay B and Steph, I love it. Nice Callie, yeah, perfect Jan. Keep going. Nice Marta, how we doing team? Woo, we'll give our wrist a little break here. One more move, five, four, three, two, oh, one more. Okay, plank jacks, in and out. A few options here. You don't need to jump it. You definitely want to keep this in line with your shoulders. You can jump in and out. You can step tap. You can come to your knees. Or if you're standing, you're going to feel your lower. You're going to tap out as if you're touching a button. Touch the button. You're going to feel the lower abdominal region start to work. We're going to come to our back here in five, four. Yes, nice guts. Awesome. Watch the low backs. No, um, don't drop that low back. So don't arch the low back. Three, especially when you jump out, you don't want to let those hips come down. Two, one, I love it, lots of versions. All right, bring it around. See the position. Knees, heels together. I'll give you a standing version too. We're gonna to bring the elbows in, extend them out. Woo, bring them in, extend them out. So some of you can straighten up that bow. Make sure you're not feeling it in the low back. Hallelujah, it's Monday. We're not missing it. We made it. September 14th. Bring it in. So a little bit of back work here. If you're standing, you can come into this chair pose and then extend it out. Bring it in. Nice long spine. Bring it out. Five. Nice lean. Four. I love it, Lauren. Lauren said, uh, Kara, you got all the friends in here today, Lauren. I love it. Three. Two, one. Actually, I said, bring it right, left. Bring it. We got three trainers. Lauren's here, too. It's always fun when your trainer besties hop into classes together. Okay, now we're adding the Russian twist. Here we go. Take the hands close. Right. Left. And I want to hear you as if you were not mute. Exhale. There you go. You bet. Yes, Amy. Lisa. Looking great. Sarah, I always want to climb your rock wall. One day I'm going to have to come to your house, play on that rock wall. The kid. Three, two, one. All right, moving on. You know them, you love them. It's a work in progress, the roll-ups. One, two, three, four, five if you can, and then we bring it up. Two, three, slow as you can. There's no strain. There's no momentum. It's all pure body control. Three, four, five. If you're sitting, you don't need to come all the way back. So just lean back, lift up, lean back. And if you're standing, let's go ahead and switch it up a little. If you're standing, you can take these windmills or you know a little bit of a spinal twist. We got two more sets left. Five, four, three. And this just roll up. Two, one. All right, this one's for you, Steph. One of my favorite moves from you. I have a standing version too. Dead bug. We're going to bring the knees right over the hips. Try not to pull them too close to your body. You really want to activate those muscles and keeping the knees right over the hips. Then we're going to extend right arm, left leg. 
Exhale. Bring it back in. We're looking for length. We're looking for control. We're looking for that low back to stay nice and flat against the floor. There'll be a little natural curve, but you don't want to feel like your chest or belly is lifting. You don't have to come as long. Maybe you just take little ones and then same thing if you're standing or so we can take it opposite Ooh, here. <laughs> so sometimes standing version is a little trickier. You got to get your balance. So right here or maybe if you're seated, you're going to take some cross body. We got options for everyone and you're at V-Fit. Yes. Five. Four, I love it, Nicole. Three, Kelly, that looks beautiful. Nice step. Diane, you're right next to Christina. There you go, Kristen. Three, nice, beautiful. And we've got the Sierra Sun family. I'm gonna talk about kids having fun with me fit too. One, all right, moving on. Everybody come on up um, to this right knee. Now you can also stand up for all of these or just kind of press your weight into the side of your body. The left leg's gonna extend. We're gonna start with some wiper, some straight arm, straight leg. And you're, feel free to go back to any of the moves we've done. Um, if there's ever a move that's not working for you, you have our permission, find something that works. Three, two, one more. Ooh, feel that. One, now I'm gonna take that top arm. I'm gonna rotate it, try to reach down behind. Bring it up. We're gonna go swimming soon, team. We're gonna go swimming to finish this off. Give you down, bring it up one more. So the only thing rotating is that upper body, down, bring it up and then take it here. So this right arm is gonna just lift off of the floor. Boom, that looked awesome. Everybody, perfect, come down. So you don't wanna, you don't wanna pull yourself up. Think about lifting up off of that floor. And then some of you will be able to lift that left leg. Three. Yes, nice tip. Lindsay is, yeah, Deb. Yeah, Fran, that was perfect. Jan, two, Karen, you guys are looking good. Allie, you guys are right next to each other. I don't know if you both know each other. You're both Lauren's friends. All right, other side. Boom, swing it over. Ah, and I am recording this. It's been a couple of weeks. Uh, this, this is a great on demand just because, let's be real, it's 15 minutes. You can do it and everywhere. Bring it out. A couple wipers here. Three. So I'm just lifting. I don't need a crunch. It's more of a lift. One. Then we take it, thread that needle. So try not to let the hips roll forward. We come down. We come up. We come down. Cool. Anyone else need this? Remind yourself this, like if you're feeling sluggish, if you're feeling tired, uh, we need this. Two, one, and then here we go, lift up out of the left side. Perfect, so you can feel the difference, right? If you try to push yourself, you're not, you're using more your upper body, not really your core, whereas if you try to lift, oh, five, four, Three, what a strong group, this is fun. Perfect, two, one, and okay. We're gonna go swimming. Everybody up to their knees and their feet. I wish we could really all go swimming. <laughs> all right, we're gonna start with the butterfly. We're just gonna take a few practice strokes. This is working our backside. You can get your heart rate up a little. Butterfly. Sound effects always welcome in this series. And then backstroke. If you're on your knees, you're gonna have to use your core a little bit more to steady yourself. I look at a few of you that I know have pulls at your houses. Butterfly back, then breaststroke. So working the chest and the back would come out, squeeze it together. Okay, we're gonna have one minute sprint to finish class. One more, and then slightly look down. We're in a freestyle. I mean, it's really hard to do this without making sound effects. So I hope you guys are all making some good swimming sound effects. All right. Beat fitters, take your mark. We're swimming at IM. Butterfly, go. Butterfly, stay nice and strong. Four. Strong, don't be tipping around. Butterfly, two hands are going to touch the wall here in five, four, three, two, one. Come up a little back. Back, really move that water. 
That's where the sound effects butterfly. Get a good range of motion through those shoulders. Six, five. You only need to touch with one hand here. Four, three, two, one. Butterfly back. Rest. And don't forget, lit Coach B has youth conditioning at two. It's not just for kids. Butterfly back. Rest. Come on. Move that water. Squeeze. Squeeze those shoulders. Three, two, one. Chin slightly down. Let's go to the finish line. To the finish line. Woo. All together. This will give us a good little boost to end with five. Four, three, two, one. Oh, I always like that one. It's only a minute. Gives you some cardio. You know me, I'll sneak in cardio wherever I can. <laughs> Just to make sure that neck didn't tense up. All right, coast to coast. And in between, we had Wisconsin, Texas, everyone in the house today. All right, you're free to go about your afternoon. Well, um, and if you want to join me on Facebook and Instagram, you now have nine minutes. Nine, and it's a nine minute workout. All right. I was trying to unmute everyone. <laughs> Thank you all. Okay, there we go. Thank you. Have Thank you day. so much. Bye, bye Ramina. Bye, Ali. Oh, bye, Montgomery family. Bye, Fran. Good job. Ali, Diane, Tiff. Terry, awesome. All right.